Hey guys, welcome back to another video. So this is the promised dormitory video. I have promised you in my campus tour video, which you can watch here, that I will do a dormitory video. And today I'm gonna do just like that. This is the international house tour of Dongsu University, the student dormitory for international students. Let's see what's inside. Go. Okay, first to get inside, you can either use a fingerprint or if you're like me, whose fingerprint is hard to read and they will give you some kind of key which you can just like that and it's open You can go inside uh, On your left here is the locker for students where they will receive the letters On the right here is a smile box uh, Here students can order something online and the things will be delivered here and then in front we have a heat camera because of the pandemic right now we have to get our body temperature check and if our temperature is above the normal level we will be sent to the quarantine room so yeah this is the heat camera to check so on the left of the front entrance uh, this is the waiting room so students can just hang out around here or wait around for their friends you can see there are couch, couches here, television, one of to watch television and yeah there is some workout tools and there is television and there is piano usually students come here to study together or just hang out and wait for their friends to come okay let's move on, moving on this is the washing room so as you can see, there are washing machines here, which students can use. Uh, you have to pay 1000 won for each use. Uh, you put your money here. If it's a paper money, you put it here. And if it's a coin, you put it here. Yep, so this is the washing machine. And next to the washing machine, we have the drying machine. Again, you have to pay the same way. It's 1000 won. It accepts paper and coin. And this is the drying machine. Yep. Okay, right next to the washing room, it's the kitchen, as you can see. So the dormitory provides us a kitchen as a facility, so we students can cook here. So in the kitchen, there are also two public fridges that we students can use. And then there are also microwave here that you can use to heat up your food and stuff. And there is like a basin sink as well to wash your dishes and stuff. There are two kinds of stoves in the kitchen. One is the old one, it's the manual one, which you can turn on just simply by turning this, the heater. See, it's getting hot now. Yeah. And there are also the newer one. This one is an electronic one. You use this by touch screen like this. Yeah, it's like that. Yeah, so this is to increase the heat and all. See, it's getting hot as well. Yep, so that's it. And there are also shelves here to keep your cooking utensils and cooking ingredients. And it's not just the shelf actually, you can also keep your cooking utensils inside the drawer right here. Uh, so, this is some of my friends actually. <laughs> friends cooking utensils, yep. So it's very convenient if you want to cook and you want to save money because food in Korea can be a bit pricey so you can maybe just buy raw ingredient and cook it yourself here right in the kitchen moving on we will check the students room <coughs> which is my room so we will go there by elevator okay in each floor of the dormitory, we have this dispenser, so we can get our water here for free. Okay, now we will see what's inside the dorm room. Okay, welcome to my room. So as you can see, there are two beds here. That means that it's two people per room. And here's the bed. Uh, just so you know, they don't give you the pillow or the blanket or the bed sheet. You have to get it all by yourself. Uh, when you first come here, they will only give you the bed. Yep, and that is a picture of me. Don't mind that. <laughs> mm -hmm. 
so this is my refrigerator just a side note again they don't give you this you have to buy this for yourself okay so this is a drawer for shoe there is shoe drawer again there are one for each person and then there are closets too as you can see again it's one for each person and then next this is the bedroom yep so the nice thing about this dorm is the bedroom is actually inside the room rather than outside the room and you have the shower you have the sink and the old good toilet the good old toilet yeah okay this is the air conditioner controller so yeah uh, right now it's off because it's winter and because it's winter it's already cold that's why they turn off the air conditioner this is the air conditioner actually yep uh, and but when it's winter the air conditioner might be off but they turn on the heater so this is the heater controller you can control uh, the heat for your room uh, but during summer of course this is not on but the air conditioner is on and it's free actually you don't have to pay extra electricity bill for the heater or the air conditioner over there now that we got all the basic stuff out there let's see my stuff so they give out these drawers this one is my roommates this one is mine so there are two desks here one for each person that one is my roommates this is one this one is mine okay let me show you what i have okay so this is my desk this is my laptop where i do my work and stuff and then you can see over here that's my pool for eating my drinking bottle tissue and my mirror hey guys <laughs> okay and this is my mask and stuff because you have to wear mask all the time when you go outside don't forget that stay safe guys my tissue and then the calendar from the g star <laughs> that i got which you can watch here if you want to know uh, and then this is my top racks so this is my snacks and stuff this is my cooking ingredients and this is my all my coins that I have collected ever since I come here in Korea Boy, it's quite heavy actually and then this is another ingredient of mine soy sauce from my home country Indonesia some medicine my old trusty ramyeon to keep me company in the middle of the night when I got hungry and then some black pepper oh f and this is my cooking equipment I put it in my room uh, you, you can also put it in the kitchen but I just prefer to put it here I also got my rice here yeah my rice so I can cook my rice in my rice cooker right here uh, just a side note uh, <laughs> you're actually not allowed to have a rice cooker inside your room but I think most students have it anyway <laughs> yep just just so you know just so you know Oh, and then you also get these nice views from the window So yeah, from this window you can see the beautiful city of Busan wow, This view is especially beautiful during the sunset As you can see the sun's golden reflection on the white buildings uh, You can see there, there are some cars that are moving Extraordinary views And you can see the mountains too <laughs> There are lots of mountains actually in Busan, you can hike them. If you want to see my hiking video, you can click the video right here. Alright guys, so that's about it about my room. I will just give you guys another look of the room without me talking over it so you can get a better idea of it. Okay, so here is the room.
okay for the price I forgot to mention this the price is calculated each master so it's around 530,000 yeah it's 530,000 Korean won and that is for four months and if you decided to stay for the vacation months which is usually spent for around two months you have to pay for another 400,000 yeah around 400,000 Korean won so I guess that's it for today's video guys if you guys want to see more about my campus in Korea you can click the video right here if you want to see my daily life as a graduate student in Korea you can click the video here or if you just want to see my daily life in general you can click the video here and thank you all for watching I will see you in the next video don't forget to subscribe bye guys